In this tutorial, we will learn about a useful technique that can help you to access numerous furniture models like this, absolutely free from the IKEA design team. You can use them freely in any project, just in one click. So once you are within Blender, go to the Edit menu and open Preferences from here. Now go to the Extensions tab, and in the search box, you have to search for the word IKEA. You'll get the IKEA browser add-on, which you can install from here. Then if we expand the details of this add-on, we can see that it needs network and file access, so go to the System tab, and under the Network section, ensure that the online access is enabled for Blender. But if you are using an older version that does not have extensions, you can search for this add-on in the Add-ons tab, and install it in the same way. Now within the viewport, press the N key on the number pad to get this side panel, and you'll see a new tab here called IKEA. There is a search box at the top, we can search for any furniture like tables or chairs or cupboards, so let's search for say chair, and then hit enter. It can take some time to download the thumbnails, based on your network speed, and you'll get a list like this with many furniture models from IKEA. Now let's say we want to download or import this particular chair, so we'll click on the import button. The model will be downloaded and added into this scene. You can now move or rotate the chair, or transform it as you wish, just like any other object. It is downloaded directly from the IKEA website by the add-on, and you can edit it or change its material as well. But you may not be able to download all such models, sometimes you can also get an error. Let's say we want to download this, so we'll click on import, but we get an error, and it says that there is no 3D model associated with this product yet, IKEA may add it later. There is no way to know if a model is available, unless you try to import it. And when a model is available, it also comes with a material, which you can see in the rendered view mode. If you want, you can also modify this material, like here, we can change its base color to make it say blue, or some other color like red. We can assign a completely different material as well, and the best part is, it comes with a good topology. So you can edit the mesh or extend it further, or remodel it as per your specific requirement. There are many models like this, so let's delete this chair, and bring back the add-on panel. This time, let's search for say, wardrobe, and hit enter. We'll get these results, which we can import, or let's say we search for something else like bed. We can easily import a bed as we did earlier, and it gets added here, but it does not come with a mattress. So let's again go to the add-on and search for a mattress. We'll get a lot of options. We can select any one of them to import, and hopefully it will be available for us. So it worked, and we got a mattress for our bed, but we may need to move it upward to place it correctly, just on the bed, like this. So that's how you can use this free add-on to import more than 1,000 furniture from IKEA. And no, this is not a paid promotion, but IKEA is no doubt a great furniture company you can trust. So that's all for today. I hope you like this tutorial. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe to this channel.